Hey everybody. Okay, so this video is to go over your rough draft guidelines. Um, your first rough draft is due this Friday, the 13th. Oh, thank you, email. Um, so I'm gonna go over those guidelines with you on what you are to do. Let's just, this is what is uploaded to Blackboard for you guys. Um, I would like to think that they're simple, but sometimes people you know, forget things. So here we go. Bear with me. I get my stuff together. <laughs> okay, so you just submitted your outlines the other day. Um, I'm very happy with them. I think that it's going to make your lives so much easier as you go to write these papers, these first drafts. Um, so your paper total needs to be five to seven pages. So for your first rough draft, you only need to write three pages, three full pages, okay? <laughs> so your first page, there is no cover page, okay? I cannot emphasize this enough. There is no cover page, all right? So your first page should look something like this, okay? You guys can see me kind of circling this, this little picture, okay? So you have your heading, which has your name, the professor's name, the class, and the date, and then your header, which has your last name and your page number, okay? Everything is double-spaced. Your heading is double-spaced. All of this double-spaced. You'll notice then that they only hit enter one time, wrote their title, they hit enter one time and started their paper. There are no extra spaces. Please do not put extra spaces. It drives me bonkers. There is no need. I know you're trying to make your page longer. You will get points off. So just don't do it, <laughs> okay? In this particular stage of the draft, you do not need to include a um, works cited page. However, for your second rough draft, you will be including your works cited page. So I advise and recommend <laughs> that you still try to put it together as you're working on it. Um, okay, remember that it's going to be a separate page. So if you hit the minimum page requirement, okay, fifth page is page of content, and then page six will be your works cited page. Please do not write four pages worth of content and think that you hit your page requirement because your work cited is on page five. That is not how this works. Okay, I need five full pages of content. Anyway, okay. If you can't think of a title right now, don't worry about it. No need to write one, okay. You can just put title in the placeholder. As long as you have something there to hold the place of a title, that's really all I'm looking for at this moment. Um, sometimes the title writes itself when you're done because you have completed your paper. You know now strongly what your paper is about and you can confidently come up with a title. Okay, your title is supposed to be like your 30 second elevator pitch. Some a very like short summary of what your paper is about, okay? Um, if you have a really hard time starting your paper, okay? I know that I included that intro 101 um, worksheet a while ago. I'll include it again in this email. Um, you need like a hook. If you have a hard time doing this, just start writing the parts of your paper out. Your introduction will write itself later. Once you know, once you know what you're introducing, you can go back and go write that. So don't, don't stress too much about how do I start this paper? But then again, remember, you guys have essentially done this work already. You wrote your outline. So refer back to your outline and see what did I put here to start? Oh, that's right. And then you can type away. Okay. Um, other times you can always free write. That might help. Um, so keep in mind, please, the following things. You're writing in Times New Roman, 12 point font. Everything is double spaced. Can't <laughs> emphasize that enough either. Um, no first person, no second person. So that means no I, me, we, you, us, our. We are writing in third person. They, them, their people, persons, readers, viewers, watchers, listeners, okay? Um, what else? Watch your citations. Make sure you are including your citations. Just because you are not putting a work cited page does not mean I'm not looking for your citations. It will be 10 times harder for you to go back and add those if you try to do it last minute. Um, what else? What else, what else, what else? Uh, make sure that proper nouns are capitalized. Make sure words are spelled correctly. You know, general, general things <laughs> that we all look for. Um, okay, make sure when you include a quote that you are going over it, explaining it, what it means, 
Um, how does it relate back to your thesis? How does it relate to what you're proving? Okay. Um, I just had something else and I don't remember it now. Shoot. It'll come to me eventually. Hopefully. <laughs> I hope. Um, what else was I going to say? Shit. I don't know. It'll come. At some point today, it'll hit me and I'll have to send another email. Um, all right, I think that's about it for now for the rough draft, okay? Uh, if you guys have questions on the rough draft, please send me a message. Maybe I'll open up a discussion board on Blackboard to ask questions about the rough drafts. I don't know, you guys let me know, <laughs> right? And I will talk to you guys later. I hope you guys have a good week. Again, remember if you have questions, please, please, please feel free to send me a message, okay? Either email, or through text, whichever. Okay. And I will talk to you guys later. Have a good week. Bye guys.